Okay. This is the button machine. It needs to be fixed onto the table. Two screws through these holes. One at the back if you need it. But two should hold the machine down and that should be fixed on the table. Okay. This is the handlebar that you need to turn to make the actual button. You get this die with the machine. This is how it is assembled. Two parts at the top. These two parts are the top bits and these three are the bottom bits the spring, the central part and the middle bit the middle bit goes in this so what you do is you undo this nut and the middle bit goes in there Okay. then you can tighten it okay. the spring and the central bit goes there so the bottom assembly is done now the top bit, you can see this is in here, the button is of two parts, so the bottom of the button, like that, goes in here, okay, it sits in there. Now the top bit, you cut your fabric in a circle, that circle has to be this size, not more than that. So that's the size you need to cut your fabric. Then the button upside down with your finger push it in. Okay, like that, and then the <coughs> excess, fa excess fabric just pushes underneath it. Yeah, upside down, and now turn. If it's fixed on the table, it'll do it properly. Okay. Thank you.